Hello developers, we are starting a new course on Swift UI language. So first question is what is Swift UI? Swift UI is a language introduced by Apple to create UIs in new language. In simple words, we can say it's a replacement of old school storyboards. And also we can say it's the replacement of classes. Because we are going to use structures to create the UIs. If we see the examples of storyboard, we are, we are using classes there. So now we can easily say Swift UI is the replacement of storyboard and the classes. Here we can see the example. We are creating a list which consists of an image and two text itself. So in Swift UI language, there is hardly a five line of codes to create this UI. But in the case of storyboard, what we have to do, we can achieve this thing by its collection view and its table view. So what we have to do, we have to do a lot of work. We have to create a cells. We have to we have to create a class for the cell. We have a table with delegates, data source, a lot of code. And but in the case of Swift UI, you can say we and we have to write hardly of five line of code, and the list is ready. Yeah! <laughs> This is the app we are going to develop in our course. I named it as a meal time. So this is a home interface. From your location, it will show the nearby stores of uh, food items. This is the home interface where we have a what would you like to eat, what's the popular, what's the top of the week, and the nearby food stores and the user recipes. Okay, so here are the user recipes we are uh, we are showing, and and this is all things are in Swift UI language itself. So here in the top there are two options menu and there is the option of cart. And you click on the menu option. So basically you are getting the login option first of all when you are not logged in the app, and when you write the write your number. So basically you have to log in, in this app, you write the login, you get the OTP in your number. So we are writing the OTP and we proceed and now we are logged in the app. So now you click on the menu, you get your profile options and you, you can see the animation also. Swift UI makes the animation easy. So you can learn some animations also here in this course. So and as in the backend, we are using Firestore. So if you see the nearby food stores, we go to see all. So we are fetching the nearby stores from Firestore itself. So this is Sankati stall. And what we are going to do, we click on the Sankati stall and we get the info, we get the details and the food of the Sankati stall itself. This is the map view. We, uh, we are going to learn how to implement the map in the Swift UI, or, uh, Swift UI language. And this is the items, food items we can say in the Sankati stall. So when we, when we click on the any item we get the description of uh, description of that food item uh, we get the image we have the descriptions of all the things if you click on the menu we have a profile my location and uh, logout option so when you go to my profile uh, you go to the profile option of yours your information uh, cool information and the recent orders you have from the stores okay so if we go to back we have a my location also and how to get your your locations and you have to just confirm your location from this course you are gonna learn Swift UI language MVVM architecture Firestore map implementation in Swift UI so stay tuned for our next videos